Hey, what is going on guys, Raw here, and today I'm going to be bringing you an awesome GTA 5 glitch, how to get any vehicle on GTA 5 for free. This is the new cars, and this is also any other DLC cars that you want as well, guys. Now, what you want to do is follow each step I do, so you don't make a mistake. What you want to do, guys, is go into single player, and you want to grab a car that you want to get this, and all you want to do is do a quick save at Franklin's house, like I've done here. Now, guys, make sure you follow each step, because if you don't, you might do it a patched way, and it won't work. So make sure you do what I do. What you want to do is go to invite session only and uh, go online again now after you've done that. Now guys, if you could just drop a like, that would mean a while to me because I took a long time to edit this and make this video. So it would give me some support and I know that you guys enjoy. Now guys, what you need to do is get back into the online session. You just want to get in a car and you just want to go back up to Franklin's house where I left off on single player. Now what you want to do from here guys is go to options and make sure your set location is last location. What you want to do after that is change your hat so it saves and your guy is stuck here. And you just want to click on the D-pad and go back to Michael or Franklin depending on what character you are in single player. Now once you've done this guys, all you want to do is go to game, load game. And you just want to load your game back up and you should spawn up at Franklin's house like you left off at last time. Now guys, once you've gotten back onto there, all you want to do is go join a GTA online session, invite only. And once you've done that guys, you will be back at Franklin's house online. Now again guys, what you want to do here is click go to the Xbox store and once it comes up the first bubble, what you want to do is unplug your Ethernet cable and you have to do it on the first bubble, like the flash, when it goes to there. You want to go to GTA single player again and just click load game once you get back into it guys. Now once you do this guys, you should be back at Franklin's house again. Now this is the last time you have to go to Franklin's house, uh, I know it's quite repetitive but this is the only way it's working at the moment guys. What you want to do is you want to change character to your online character and it should say your uh, downloadable pack needs to be re-downloaded. Just download it again guys and once you've downloaded it, it doesn't take that long, you will be able to get back online and it will put you back into the GTA online servers with a lot of people and you will also have the car of your choice that you've chosen. Now guys, this is a really easy glitch, really. If you just follow step by step, uh, go slow when you're doing it, and you should manage to do this, guys. So guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. Hit that like button and give me some support, guys. I did take a long time to do this. And guys, this cars cannot be stored straight away. You have to do another glitch. If you guys do want to see that glitch tonight, because I need to go out right now. So guys, when I get back tonight, if I can hit some 200 likes, I will post a video tonight on how to do it. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.